how it starts off, right, that's what mm -hmm. we call foundation. And that's the pattern of honeycomb, and the bees um, draw that out to become like that, all right? Now that, in there, Lily, the darker, thing, the darker stuff is uh, pollen. You see that dark stuff? Yeah. Is pollen. That there is a male bee, a big one, a drone. Mm -hmm. You see those drones, look? Yeah. They're the big drone bees. They're the males. And in there, you see those grubs in there? Mm -hmm. Those grubs in those big cells will become drones, right? right. They'll, they'll become drones, they will. Now that is a lovely comb, uh, as we call it. And if you look, you have to ca catch the light correctly. In the bottom of each one of these little cells here is a little tiny white sausage of an egg. Mm. And she lays the egg, the egg turns into a grub, they put a lid on top of it, and then it becomes a it becomes a new bee. And that is a lovely frame of bees, that is, that's that's super. It really is. We've got a little bit of what's called chalk brood. Oh, wait a minute, there's the queen bee. Hang on, Lily. That there's the queen. All That's right. the boss. Can I just she's the one. Look at that. She's a beauty. Now, if you notice, Lily, she isn't hugely bigger, mm -hmm. but she is. She is a very, very distinctive shape. She's the mother of every one of these bees. I am ever so pleased you've seen the queen. Although she's on your finger. Yeah, she's, she, she'll come back again. There she is. Shall we mark her, Lily? Where's she gone? You re we really should be holding this over the hive, so if she drops off, she mm. she drops back in again. Come on, Lily, I've seen her once. Where is she? Now, what I'm going to do is get her in the open, like that. Right? Mm -hmm. And gently press that. She, she can't get out of there. Right. Now wait till she's in the middle, press it down gently, mm -hmm. and a little blob of ink, make it dry, and then we have a marked queen, oh, okay. right? You've seen a very rare thing there, Lily. Not very often I find the queen and mark her, right? Yep. So I'm going to pop her back in while she's in good fettle. That's absolutely superb. I'm really pleased you've seen that. The varroa, I want to know how much varroa, or get a guide of how bad the varroa is. Mm. And when we get down to this level here and lift that box off, which we shall, the, the floor of this of this um, hive has got a, is a, is got a metal mesh, right? And I've got some cardboard and I'm going to pin it underneath I'm going to turn that over and pin it on and put it all back together again and then a week later I shall have a look and see how many of the varroa mites have dropped through onto the paper okay. they, they die mm -hmm. and you, you can count them now this one uh, we'll just have a quick look in the super first and see what what one is selling what is it puts them on alarm we will try that again, look at that, that's absolutely brilliant, that's honey, and hopefully this year we shall get some honey out of this one, that's lovely new wax with honey on it, um, and really we've got all the rest of July and August, and it, it, we shan't have, I shan't have anything like the amount of honey I had last year, but it's it's just, uh, been a, we had the problem with, the, with the, the, this thing called foul brood, and uh, we're going to lift this off, Lily. Really. Now what we'll do is have a look in this brood box and see how they how how they uh, are producing. They often build wild wax. We call this brace comb or wild comb. That's perfectly normal, they store honey all over the place. That's just honey being stored. Right? That is. We'll put that down for a minute. These again 
a very nice bees. If you're, if you're back-tempered lily, they'd be zooming all over the place. Now that there, around the outside of there is honey. That that's sealed with light there is honey. That that's sealed in the middle there, right, has, has got new bees in. It's always a slightly different colour. Mm -hmm. There's not a lot of... Now if you look down, if you look... Wait a minute, I've lost me. So let's see how it's going further on. I'm hoping I shall see more brood than that. Now oh, there's, there's plenty of brood there. You see that 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 is happening all the time, and there's eggs in here. She's she's not far away. The lady isn't, but the boss isn't. But I don't know where. There's there one being born. Yeah. Do you want to see it out or not? No, I think it's going to take a while, isn't it? I think it's going to take a No other eggs in here. No, the grub's in there. It, she'll take some finding in here because a lot of bees. And it, it, I often find that it's just no. a bit of a gentle blow and they spread apart. But, I mean, that, that you often find them when you're not looking for the damn thing. Oh, she's there. And she's oh, got yeah. a mark on. She's there. Oh, yes. And she's got some yellow paint on, look, but not very much. You can see. Mm -hmm. Now look at the long body. She's a beauty, look at that. Isn't she a belter? Look at that lovely long abdomen. Can you see her? There's the mesh floor, look. Now oh, there is it big enough for one Perfect, isn't it? Yeah. See now the bees are all confused. See they're flying round and you where the level of the hive gone. And we'll see what happens in a minute. difficult to do this without crushing the odd ones out. Right, from a different flower, simple as that. All, all different, all flowers produce different coloured pollens, and sometimes they come in with it like bright orange on. And in the spring, when it when it's horse chestnut trees, you get beautiful maroon pollen. That's what WBC stands for, but. Back on. There is one or two in the tree, but there's yellow pollen, look. There's the orangey stuff. Mm-hmm. Hey, great! Yeah. <laughs> Clumsy, 